Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a new video. I'm gonna try out the Jackie Aina palette today. It's been a very long time since it has come out and uh, it's been quite a few days since I've got the palette and I have one face palette as well. So I'm gonna try out that and a couple of new lipsticks. So just few things to try out today in the video. Before starting the video, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a video. The link to my Instagram is also there in the description below. So just check it out if you want and also subscribe to my hubby's gaming channel if you are interested so anyways let's just start the video for today's video i have this anastasia beverly hills jackie aina palette as you can see the palette sleeve is so damn beautiful with this reptile kind of texture and holographic colors so damn beautiful this is mostly designed for deeper skin tones but you can use it all the skin tones can use this palette it is not necessary that only deeper skin tones can use this palette but jackie aina has mostly designed it for deeper skin tone as she is as she has a deeper skin tone it is a very beautiful palette and as you can see this is how it looks from inside very similar to the sleeve anastasia has amazing eyeshadows the formula is really great the shimmer metallic shades are so good they blend like a dream the mattes blend like a dream they are very very soft creamy buttery and the metallics and shimmer shades they are they feel very very wet when you use it so it is for very very good quality so this is how the palette looks from outside now from inside as you can see these are all the colors and it looks like it is meant for deeper skin tone but i mean it has pretty amazing purples and brown shades and beautiful metallics shimmers and duochrome shades so i think it's a very beautiful palette so i the shade zam is very very beautiful i think it is a duochrome shade and the shade sponsored both are very beautiful and i think both are duochrome shades and i think even the shade lituation i think this is also a duochrome shade so we will try out that and i'll give you all the swatches that is for sure and for the face palette i have this jouer rose gem cut blush palette so it has six blushes and one highlighter so we will try out that so quickly i'll tell you a few things about the palette so this is the anastasia beverly hills into jackie aina palette and this is for 45 dollars i think usually when they are collab palette i think they go for 45 what they have increased from 42 to 45 i'm not sure but this is for 45 dollars jackie aina has collabed with anastasia to create her palette with the colors that she can't live without her must-have colors and she has all pigments pressed shadows uh, in the palette so you can create both neutral as well as daytime to nighttime and bold looks as well so there are three uh, pigments in there uh, the shade supreme pinker and big wig all three matte shades are pigment shades so you have a couple of uh, mattes couple of uh, pigment shades and couple of metallics shimmers duochrome shade so we will see how it is gonna perform on the eyes so yeah let's get into swatching so first we have the shade sole this is a metallic soft peach color with gold shimmers to it very beautiful golden shimmery color then we have the shade supreme which is a matte pigment and it is more of a rosy pink color beautiful pink color and as you can see it is a pigment so it is kind of staining my finger so just be careful of that then we have the shade pinker which is again a pigment shade but it is more of a plum shade beautiful color then we have the shade big wig which is again a pressed pigment and it is classic purple color so just be aware of these colors because it might stain your eyelids as you can see it is kind of staining my fingers I'll just quickly remove a wet wipe because it's kind of staining my fingers then we have the shade dwellers which is a metallic golden olive color beautiful golden shade then we have the shade credit which is a matte brown shade and it is a very beautiful dark brown color somehow the brown shades of anastasia are really really good then we have the shade lituation situation lituation so this is metallic deep taupe with a violet shift 
damn that is a beautiful color honestly i just love that color and i want to use it all over my lids then we have the shade zam which is a sparkling rose gold this is beautiful actually i don't know whether you can see but it is very very sparkly and it is looking pretty amazing i mean the swatches are so damn good then we have the shade wigglies wigglies which has metallic cranberry red color honestly beautiful color and it would really suit deeper skin tones very very well then we have the shade shookington which is a metallic violet color with blue shift this is also a beautiful shimmer shade this is also a beautiful metallic shade then we have the shade trust issues this is a sparkling white gold color the sparkling colors a um, little bit chunky not in a bad way but just a little bit chunkier than their metallic and shimmer shades so as you can see this would look really good all over the lids and even in the inner corners it would look really great then we have the shade edges which is a matte deep peach color it is more of a warm brown color also it is very beautiful then we have the shade sponsored which is a metallic chocolate color with teal shift to it this is the classic shade which has the base of a brown color and has a ton of teal blue green shimmers to it so it is a dual shift color then lastly we have the shade ginger which is a matte caramel brown color so as you can see these are all the swatches very beautiful swatches i mean the shade these two shades zam and lituation they are beautiful honestly they are very very beautiful so yeah now i'll quickly just prime my eyelids and i'll be right back and then we'll do eye look on it so i think i will start with the shade edges dark peachy color i will put this on my entire eyelids the shade is really blending very very nicely and this brush is really good i got it from beauty bay from uh during black friday sale and it, i think it was only for two pounds it is a really nice blending brush i think i got three or four of that so this color is really blending very very nicely and this would be a very nice color just on its own for every day it would look actually really nice so now on a much fluffier brush i need to wash my brushes anyways now i I think I am going to take the shade pinker and I think I'll just put it in my outer corners. That is a pretty nice plum shade. And I'm just going to put it on my entire lid. just going to blend the color so it doesn't look harsh now actually i don't know what color i want but i think i want to use the shade lituation so i am gonna use the shade lituation and i'm not gonna use concealer for doing this actually kind of not looking good on the eyes i am going to take the shade sponsored and put it all over my lids that is a duo chrome shade so it is looking pretty amazing So as you can see, it is looking so damn beautiful. Now I'm going to take the shade pinker again and I'm just going to put it on my outer one third and just blend the matte and the shimmer shade. Damn, this is such a beautiful color. And I'll just deepen a little bit with the shade credit which is the dark brown color.
now taking a fluffy brush and just blending the colors so this is what i am going for now quickly i'll do my left eyes off camera i'll do the rest of my face then we'll do a lower lash line we'll do try out the face palette and lips and we will be done so i'll be right back so i did the rest of my face i did the other eye as well and i did the lower lash line so now quickly we'll just do the other lower lash line so for that i'll just tell you quickly what i've used so i've used the shade pink a very so I've used the shade pink on my lower lash line and then I have used the shade credit to just very very close to my lash line using an angled brush and then I have used the shade edges to just blend the colors and I have used the same brownish green color till one third of my inner corners and for my inner corners I have used the shade Soleil and Trust Issues and uh, black liquid liner and i've just used the shade pinker and credit to just create a wing using eyeshadow so quickly we'll just do that so quickly we'll just do that So guys this is what my eyes is looking and i have used the shade trust tissues on my eyebrow bow uh, eyebrow bone as well so this is what we are going for the i look now for the face i have this jouer blush palette it has six blushes and one highlighter so it looks like this beautiful blush palette i always wanted their dual blushes or the blush palette but i never got it so i had ordered this palette during black friday sale so i almost got it for half the price so it was a very very good deal so for today i'm going to use this color which is the shade garnet and i am just going to put it on my face it is a very beautiful berry kind of shade actually it is very very pigmented so just be careful and use a light hand so i think for highlighter maybe i'll use this color only so yeah let's see first i'll just spray my face so i think first we'll try out this highlighter if it doesn't go well i'll use my regular highlighter but let's see i will try out this for because it is a very beautiful champagne gold color So I think the highlighter is pretty good, not that very blinding but uh, kind of liking it. So once you are done with your highlighter, I am just going to spray a little bit once more so it just melts into my skin. Now for lips, I have a couple of lipsticks but I am honestly not sure. Please avoid the sound. I'm honestly not sure whether the color is gonna go with the look or not but we'll just see first I have the NARS audacious lipstick I have the shade Rita which is a beautiful uh, red color and then I have the shade Bridget uh, this is a nude color but I'm not sure whether it is gonna go this is the shade this might go let's see first i'll try the nude color so first i'm trying the shade bridget it 
is so creamy i think this color will look actually pretty good so i think i'll go with this and then i have a lip gloss to try so we'll try out that and rita is a beautiful red color so that would be very very loud for my eye look so that is why i'm not using it then i have the artist couture lip gloss i have two shade i have the shade sugar baby and four play so this is more of a pinky kind so i think this might go and then i have the shade four play which is more of a goldenish color so i think i'll use the shade uh, sugar baby today so this is how the packaging is looking and this is more of a thick uh, gloss so it is not the regular gloss but it is very very beautiful and uh, there are tons of shimmers in it so it looks pretty amazing can you see how damn beautiful it is it is a bit thick but it is not it doesn't stick your lips so that is really good so this is how my lips is looking kind of got a little bit of pimple here i don't know why but it was kind of bothering me since a very long time so this is what my eyes is looking now i'll quickly do my eyelashes and i'll be right back and then i'll finally give you my thoughts about it and we'll be actually done with the video so i'll be back in just a few minutes so guys this is the final look i have applied the huda beauty olivia lashes i think i love this lashes a lot i think this is my favorite from all the lashes it looks really good and it fits my eyes really well that is why i like it and i actually didn't do anything to my hair just added a few uh, accessories so guys i actually love this palette there is nothing bad about it and the color sponsored which is on my eyes it is very very beautiful i actually love how the eye look turned out and the best part is not the best part the worst part is i completed my entire face and later on i realized i forgot to add concealer i was thinking my why my dark circles are showing so actually i forgot to add concealer then i just took a little bit of concealer and i just on my under eyes and just patted with powder but still it is not looking cakey and that is the best part because i had applied my powder all over my face and then sprayed it with a ton of spray then added blush and i don't know what what but still it is not looking cakey and it's looking pretty good and the highlighter is also very very good in all i love this palette and it suits every skin tone it will suit every skin tone if you love makeup if you love a good eyeshadow palette i don't think you will see that i mean it won't be important to you whether it is going to suit medium skin tone light skin tone deeper skin tone i think if you love makeup if you love a good eyeshadow i mean you will just love the palette so this is a very beautiful palette and the shimmer shades are very very beautiful they are i think one of the unique colors um, from anastasia that i think you should grab it and i think there was offer in us something for 50% off i'm not sure but uh, even if it's not an offer it is a very good palette and it is very very beautiful and i love the jouer blush blushes are my favorite for my entire face i think blush is one of my favorite and the packaging is so damn beautiful it looks like as if there are gems on it and but actually it is not it is just 3d effect and it is very beautiful you have all peach colors light baby pink colors mauve colors berry colors and you have a highlighter what more you want from a blush palette so it is i think really good and it is a pretty good deal and if if you find it on offer pretty good deal for a blush palette so i really love that the lipstick was really beautiful it was very very creamy that was my first nas lipstick i have ordered a few more it is it was very creamy it went on very very well i think i want to buy one or two more of that which is more of a brownie nude or a pinky nude so i can play more with it and the lip gloss was very very comfortable it is not even sticky at all it was a bit thick but it is not sticky and it is so shiny so glittery i mean you can't see the glitters uh, you can't feel it but it is so for so fine that it is so damn beautiful anyways this was actually all for my video today's video 
I don't know seriously what I'm doing and I think this top is from Zara if I'm not wrong I had got during some sale I got it for a cheaper price yeah guys if you like this video please give a thumbs up if you love this I look also do give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below if you like this video if you liked any of the product from this video please let me know in the comments below and please like and subscribe to my youtube channel please do guys subscribe to my channel I really need your support to grow my youtube channel please please do that and yeah guys i'll see you soon in my next video bye